Hey there! Welcome to Wellness Check, your helping buddy if you are concerned about your health and want to burn fat. If you're into that sort of content, please hit that like and subscribe button. Are you tired of the endless struggle to shed that stubborn belly fat? Well, you're in the right place. In today's video, we're diving into a game-changing approach that might just revolutionize your fat loss journey. It's all about building muscle to burn fat and we'll be exploring why strength-based workouts and smart dietary choices can be your secret weapons in the battles against the bulge. We've got some surprising insights coming your way, so stay tuned as we break down the science behind this approach and provide you with actionable tips to help you finally say goodbye to that unwanted belly fat for good. So, hit the subscribe button and let's get started on path to a healthier, leaner you. Many of us desire to reduce belly fat, whether it's a prominent beer belly or the stubborn layer of fat covering our lower abs. Achieving a well-defined midsection is a desirable goal as it enhances our overall appearance, attractiveness, and health. However, the journey to a slimmer waistline can often seem challenging, whether you're preparing for a beach vacation or simply seeking to boost your self-confidence. It can feel like a constant struggle where you must work hard for every inch of progress, only to see the fat return seemingly overnight when you deviate from your diet. Today, I want to provide you with practical tips that can help you effectively lose belly fat and maintain your progress in the long run. For those who prefer not to engage in calorie counting or extensive meal preparation and are looking for a straightforward approach to kickstart their belly fat reduction, one effective method is to combine fasting with a diet consisting of a single ingredient, natural foods. This approach is remarkably uncomplicated. You either limit yourself one or two meals a day and ensure that these meals are composed of foods that are either grown from the earth or sourced from animals. That's the entire concept simplicity at its core. With this strategy, you can eat until you're comfortably full without worrying about overeating because the real, natural foods you're focusing on, which aren't found packaged in the inner aisles of the grocery store but in their original, unprocessed forms and mostly located around the outer perimeter of the store, have a low calorie density. In other words, they provide relatively few calories in large quantities. Consequently, your stomach will naturally start feeling full with a relatively low calorie intake. By filling up these low calorie density foods just once or twice a day, you'll create a significant calorie deficit, prompting your body to tap into its fat stores, including belly fat, with minimal effort on your part. The only drawback is that it might take a little time to adapt to skipping breakfast if you're opting for two meals a day or waiting until dinner if you're going for just one meal daily. However, after a week or two of fasting, your body will adjust its hunger patterns and the release of hunger and satiety hormones like ghrelin and leptin. <laughs> Moving on to the next tip, to optimize the effectiveness of this diet or almost any calorie deficit plan for fat loss, you should prioritize protein. Single ingredient protein sources include foods such as chicken breast, ground beef, steak, salmon, whitefish, ground turkey, shrimp, shellfish, tuna, eggs, Greek yogurt, and cottage cheese. <laughs> Additionally, for vegetarians or vegans, options like seitan, black bean pasta, and tofu are excellent sources of protein without animal-based ingredients. Prioritizing protein is essential for several reasons. Firstly, protein is exceptionally filling, helping you achieve a sense of satisfaction during meals without consuming excess calories. Moreover, protein requires more energy to digest, a phenomenon known as the thermic effect of foods. Compared to fats or carbohydrates, protein has a significantly higher thermic effect, ranging from 20% to 35%, meaning that a substantial portion of the calories you obtain from protein sources is expended just for the digestion and assimilation of nutrients. Additionally, Protein aids in muscle building and maintenance, especially if you're consuming at least 0.73 grams of protein per pound of body weight per day, which translates to about 1-2 to two pounds of animal-based protein sources for most men. Next tip is focus on building muscle instead of burning fat. It might seem counterintuitive, but directing your workouts toward muscle building rather than fat burning can be highly effective. Muscles are metabolically active tissues that demand a significant amount of energy to maintain. This means that even at rest, they continue to burn calories. 
to achieve this, prioritize strength-based exercise like deadlifts, squats, bench presses, pull-ups, and rows. Aim for an average 6-10 to 10 repetition per set while using heavy weights. Over time, your muscle fibers will undergo microscopic tears, initiating a process called muscle protein synthesis. This process demands energy and alleviates your metabolic rate, leading to continued calorie burning even after you've finished exercising. Next, enhance muscle mass and insulin sensitivity. Increasing your muscle mass through strength training offers several benefits. Firstly, it amplifies your body's insulin sensitivity, improving how it regulates glucose. This can help prevent excess glucose from being stored as fat, particularly around the belly area. Additionally, building more muscle leads to a higher resting metabolic rate, which means you burn more calories even when you're not active. Think of muscle as a metabolic furnace, constantly consuming energy to maintain itself. Next tip is muscle and glycogen storage. Your muscles also serve as storage containers for glycogen, which is essentially stored sugar or carbohydrates used to power muscle contractions. When you engage in intense weightlifting, you deplete a significant portion of muscle glycogen stores. Subsequently, when you consume carbohydrates, the glucose produced can be stored within these glycogen-depleted muscles. However, if you have poor insulin sensitivity and your glycogen stores are full, excess carbohydrates are more likely to be stored as fat. In essence, building muscle allows you to consume carbohydrates without them spilling over into fat storage. Next tip is strength training versus cardio. Rather than solely focusing on cardio workouts, prioritizing strength training is a scientifically supported approach. Strength training not only sculpts your physique but also makes the fat loss process more efficient and sustainable. Cardio is valuable for cardiovascular health but building muscle is equally crucial for long-term fat loss especially in the stubborn belly area. Next tip is balanced diet with fruits and vegetables. In addition to your workouts, consider the composition of your diet. Prioritize single ingredient foods like protein sources, fruits, and vegetables. When consuming meals, start with vegetables and protein to reduce cravings for calorie dense fruits. While some fruits are higher in calories, options like strawberries, blackberries, raspberries, watermelon, and apples are both low in calories and highly nutritious. The key is to eat until you're full, promoting a sustainable approach to losing belly fat. Next is emphasize consistency in enjoyable meals. Consistency is crucial in any diet plan as belly fat is often the last to disappear and the first to accumulate. Instead of frequent small meals, consider eating fewer times per day. By focusing on single ingredient foods, you can enjoy large meals without the need for calorie counting, reduce stress and making the plan more sustainable. Prioritize meals that make you feel better as this will make it easier to stick to your plan. Next is include reasonable amounts of carbs and fats. While protein is a primary focus, don't neglect carbohydrates and fats. Incorporate fats like butter and oils to make your meals enjoyable. Since these meals are relatively low in calories, adding a moderate amount of fats enhances taste. As for carbohydrates, limit starchy options for one or two servings per day to avoid overconsumption. And last but not the least, manage sleep and stress levels. Pay attention to sleep and stress management. Disrupted sleep patterns and chronic stress can disrupt hormonal balance, leading to increased cravings for calorie-dense foods and reduced self-control. Aim for at least 7 to 9 hours of quality sleep each night and incorporate stress-reducing practices like meditation to optimize your body's ability to burn belly fat. In conclusion, these tips offer a simplified and actionable approach to begin burning belly fat efficiently without excessive complexity. While this approach is effective, remember that there are various methods to achieve fat loss and what works best for you may depend on your individual preferences and needs. If you're seeking a more personalized approach, consider exploring a program tailored to your goals and preferences. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.